Hello and welcome back to Minecraft Homestead Mod Pack Part 8 of the series today. Um, it's going to be kind of a smaller video, so let's get started. Let's we'll jump right in here. Alright, so as you can see, um, we found our way back to our second home basically going to be our base going forward uh, as soon as I can get myself back and forth to it um, I did go exploring for a day and did some stuff to clean up the old base um, so basically I started with cleaning up the old base making things a little easier and then it became daytime and I was like you know what? I'm gonna go explore and see if I could find my my second home because I didn't save the coordinates last time so I saved the coordinates now so I should be able to get back to it regardless I just need to make sure daytime or I'm really ready to fight mobs so I think I went from the old base I think is over this direction and I think I went all the way around the mountains over here and then I went deep into this forest over here and I was like I can't find that village at all so I had a feeling that because I saw water in the distance when I was up here this way I was like, it's probably best to go back home. So I went this direction, figuring I'd make it home. And then I saw the hills over on the other side here. So I went towards them. And I was actually coming from this direction. I was up at like that weird pillar up there. And I was looking down, like walking towards this way. And I was like, oh, hey, there's that village. So now I know where the village is, and now I have the coordinates to get to the village. So we're going to go ahead and head back home to our original stay place. And I'm going to find a way to make it easier to get back and forth, even if it's just some quick uh, coordinates, because I know the water's here. So my house is probably on the other side of this hill. But last time we checked that out it wasn't the case so let's let's try it once more <laughs> what do I have to lose I I think it's more than just across here I think it goes around and then it goes like a, a couple different turns kinda like S curves and then it comes back and I think if I went directly this way I'd probably run almost straight to or towards the house but I could be completely wrong too. So let's just find out. And I know there's a fountain. I know the fountain near the house is a pretty big fountain. So, oh, and look at that. I see. I see some stuff over there. I think that's it right there. Maybe? No? No, that's definitely not it. Okay. I thought it looked like something I had done. So, see, that's why I think it's going this way. So I'm going to go this way. I think it's around this mountain here. Let's go ahead and eat some food. I think I explored this a little bit already. I want to say I have. Oh, yeah, I remember that. So I'm just going to go this way. Got to think of a way to make it easier to know where I'm at. And I might be able to just do that by making a map. So I think that's going to be my next goal. So this I think is that, that peninsula more or less. And there should be a cave right over here if I'm correct. Which had the copper in there. I think I blocked it off, but I'm 100% sure on that. See, so yeah, there's driftwood there, there's driftwood out there. Yep, there's the ship. This has got to be it. I didn't run into the cave, but I did know ex at least a little bit of where I was. Okay, so that's good. Now I know exactly how to get to the... Well, how to most of the way get to that village I think I just have to cut through right here and just go that direction 
and I'll get right straight to it. Um, I killed a spider, and it looked like a, it said poisonous spider, and it dropped some discs. I had no idea. I blocked myself in like I did with the orange uh, planks over here. I put two on this, two on all sides, basically up, and I just crunched down and attacked with my flint broadsword, which actually is very helpful. So. I really like that. So there's some definite changes in here. Um, I'll start with the strainer. I made myself an underground path to make it easier. Let's go ahead and... Oh, that didn't work. So I made myself a path over here. I made a second strainer and a second strainer, um, like, top. Like, a, I have a second strainer base and a second strainer. Yeah, it looks like I got some other stuff here. Um, I'm not really going to get anything out of here yet, or that yet, just because. Oh, I guess I was thirsty. I didn't realize. This has only got 24 uses left, but I'm going to leave that for now. We got plenty of bread to eat, um, and we have several other stacks. Um, so basically, I got like my bare materials here, stone, cobblestone, stuff like that. I got my food and water, so survival chest there. Um, this is still kind of random stuff. I didn't really know what to do with this area for at, for a while, so I did put all this stuff here, so like string, all, all the mob drops over here, clay there. So I just gotta make sure I try to stay a little bit more organized. I got an Enchanting bottle experience. Cool. Uh, bones. I got some oak wood. I don't know if I had that at first. I think I did go out and cut down a few trees just to kind of get myself some good old uh, wood. I found out how to make hemp fibers. Um, one, of, one of the subscribers did mention that he thinks I had a millstone and you know after he said that I came in here and I did some screwing around and that's that's what this is doing here so basically what I got out of this is that you gotta do this five times and it'll drop out three of this hemp fiber I believe for just one so if we have 20 Yeah, so uh, one hemp fiber, raw hemp fiber, gives me three hemp fiber strings that I can use in crafting, which is super hand f handy. Uh, oh, I do have another disc. Oh, you know what? I'm just going to start my own disc, like my record collection here. This That's what this is going to be for. Mm, I want to say that's the same thing. That's okay. I can have multiples for now. It's too bad I don't have like a record player yet, because it would be kind of nice to have in the background when I'm playing. Ooh. Oh, I also planted cactus fruit and bamboo shoot. Um, I found some seeds in the chest, and I'm like, hey, you know, I could probably plant this now. So I'm just trying to make it more organized in here and keep things, um, I guess, cleaner. Oh, that's right. Um, I did create multiple chests. Like, I know we made this one on camera. I don't know if we made this one on camera, but I've been putting all my seeds in there. Um, and then my mattock, of course. Um, I created this one for all my stencils. Um, I put the stencil table on the bottom because I was like, I use that the least. Um, the part builder, I'll probably use that quite often as I will need that to build stuff in here. Um, I did make an extra wood binding, so I was just like, you know what? I don't want to put it in a chest somewhere. I'm just going to put it in here. That way I don't have to worry about it. So I did some cleanup. I made this double wide and fixed the doors, made them normal doors. Um, I put the spares over here. I found an oak door that says rotating, and I didn't quite get that. I placed it and tried to walk through it, thought, thinking maybe rotating means that it will open when you walk into it, but it didn't do anything. And I remember we were making gearbox and axle pillars and stuff like that. Um, I'm not sure what material we got to make that work. 
because I know we were going to make like a windmill. Oh, I spelt that wrong again. Axle. I need hemp rope. And then just planks on each side. So I make hemp ropes by doing that. I should probably continue with that real quick. Because now that I have a good source of hemp fibers, um, I can finally take care of the next quest. So let's go ahead and get that. Um, I did watch some through some older videos too, just to kind of remember what I've all done. Because um, I got quite confused in a couple videos. Oh, check that out. I'm going to put those in there. It looks like I got six more. I think that's all I need for now. So I'm going to make a couple of those. Um, I don't have any planks. Oh, I do have any. I do have planks. Okay. Two here, two here. Make six axles. Um, that's six... Oh, I didn't need to make the flint axle after all, but I assume that that's going to make it easier to uh, craft that. So um, I did watch through some old videos, and I remembered I can use the tilde key to open this, so that's super handy. I don't have to carry that stupid book everywhere. Um, I mean, I could, um, if that's preferable, just let me know. It's going to take up another inventory slot, but that's one more inventory slot I can't use, so it would make it a little more... Um, interesting if you will uh, windmill let's go ahead and go in here windmill right there so I need windmill blades hemp fiber and slabs okay so how many do I need to make I think four yeah I need to make four for one windmill so I need to make let's see that's three fibers I'm going to make four of those, so I need... Oh, no. Oh, please don't be broken. Oh, thank you. I'm going to put that out. No. So I'm going to need... Let's see. I, I'll need three for each, so I need to make four. That means I need 12 fibers. See if we get this windmill going before I gotta get going. I apologize if the length is gonna be a little short today. Holidays make it so busy. I hope to have that completely resolved by the time New Year hits. Or just after New Year's hits. You're too exhausted to spin. Okay, darn it. Looks like I'm not gonna be able to get it all the way, but I can at least work my way in. So I know I need to make at least drying rack. Interesting. I know I need to at least make a couple of these. Okay, how do I make those again? Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. I need six hemp fibers each. It only makes one, so I'm going to need actually twice as many as I thought. <laughs> that means I need 24, and I wasted my time um, uh, making them for axles. So, um, that means, I'm, oh, I kind of need that stuff, thanks. Um, that means I can't make any more slabs out of this. I might, I wonder if I can mix match. No, actually, I have a better idea. I have extra. So that would mean that's going to make me four. So three, 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 that's four. Um, and now I need a whole bunch of fibers. Oh, I'm too exhausted. Let me try eating first. Maybe that's going to fix it. Oh, that was it. Let's get some water in the gut. Working on our way over there. Make 
two. Two windmills. Blades. That is. That's a third one. That's three of them. I just got one more to go. That means I got like a couple more spins on this thing. So I'm just basically right clicking and it's constantly spinning this thing. I mean not constantly, but consistently because it's spinning it every couple seconds or so. Oh, that's right. I thought I was done. <laughs> there it goes. Alright, now I thought I had everything and now I'm going to have everything. So, I believe it was like this. Not like that. Like that. There we go. Alright. So now we got a gearbox, gears, or axles in a windmill. So, let's go ahead and look at our quest log, huh? That does, that that didn't give me anything. Past three blocks. Okay, well, let's go ahead and place it anyway. Looks like it's nighttime, it's raining. Um, where do I want to place this? I, I have a feeling that if I break this and I place this here using shift here and I okay I can't jump through it so um, I need do I need an axe no I don't need an axe okay we're good we still don't need an axe we're good <laughs> okay Let's see if I can go outside without getting attacked it's very unlikely Oh, no. How do I do this? Please don't break it. Oh, thank god. Oh, here comes a zombie. Freaking ow. Seriously? I didn't even hear him until he was right there. Like, either I'm deaf or... Die! That's what I thought. <laughs> okay, since I know I can break these, I'm just gonna use it. Okay, well... That doesn't appear to be helping. I have a feeling I need to place it, like, on there somehow. Oh, you know what? I think I figured it out. wonder if anybody's watching. It's like, oh my gosh, come on, man. If I would've just read the directions. No. No, yeah. 13 by 13 area to work. Okay. Gonna do. Is I'm gonna revise this plan a little bit. I'm going to use. You know, I'm gonna use stone. I'm gonna go ahead and get this placed. First, I will start by moving this. Moving this. Moving this. this, because I have a feeling that this is going to spin this for me. So I'm going to try to place that there. Okay, I don't know if that's going to work. <laughs> if the hole's on the bottom, will that work? Okay, it looks like it's going to work. So I'm going to put the axles here. I'm going to go ahead and build under me a couple that, do that, do that. Oops. Thirteen by thirteen. I don't know which direction it means thirteen. 
Okay, obviously it's not high enough. Um, let's see. I don't know if... I mean, if this, if this works higher, I'd be glad to make more axles. So, I'm going to go ahead and actually build this noob tower up like this. Okay, and then I'm going to break it manually again. Crouching while doing it so I don't fall. I don't need that gearbox yet. So, I'm going to go ahead and continue building this upwards. ahead and go right here place this gearbox wait no. oh that's right okay well I'm gonna place this gearbox best as I can heck why not and then place the axle down I'm gonna dig my way back down again This is why I chose stone, because I'm like, with wood, I mean, it's going to take forever to break that down. Let's see if I can place that one. Nope. <laughs> I want to break all these. That way there's nothing obstructing the windmill's path. Super awesome windmill tower, by the way. <laughs> it's professional grade. There she is! Whoa. What the hell just happened? <laughs> Apparently it doesn't like that one. Wait, what? What? Am I not allowed to have it that big? Oh. What the? I'm so confused as to why that wasn't working at first. It looks like my gearbox is already damaged. Probably because it kept failing? I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna see if I can make more axles before I gotta get going. Let's see. Spell it the right way, man. Treated wood axe. Oh, you know what? Treated wood planks. I'm gonna worry about that later. I need more hemp rope. That's okay. Um. Oh, I gotcha. That means I have to break this down and place this block here so nobody can get in. And. Looks like I'm actually running out of time, so thank you for joining me. Um, hope you enjoy it. Uh, give me any suggestions in the comment, it'd be great. Uh, thank you, and have a great day.